The Barry Art Museum is a cultural hub at Old Dominion University in Norfolk, Virginia. Our mission is to advance the understanding of art in its many diverse forms through collecting, display, interpretation, and research. This tour will highlight artworks specifically representing African-American voices or depicting black subjects, history, and stories in our permanent collection. We start with American modern and contemporary paintings. Many of these pieces created by African-American artists depict black culture in America and even reflect our local community right here in Norfolk. For example, Alexander Brooks Jackson was the first African-American faculty at Old Dominion University. In his Porch People series, he illustrates his neighbors in Norfolk's Ghent. A new acquisition to the collection by Ted Ellis puts black students at the forefront of a new history in the STEAM fields of science, technology, engineering, art, and math. With a more abstract approach, Devin Troy Struther incorporates the black experience through humor and language relevant to his peers and does not shy away from the irreverent. Next, we delve into contemporary glass sculpture, a field that historically has lacked accessibility and diversity. Artist Deborah Moore joyfully explores the allure of orchids. While Thurman Statham creates ladders, a symbol of growth and change. This new piece in our collection probes the tension of graffiti and ornament. It is a collaboration between African-American glassblower Leo Tokoski and Swedish engraver Simon Clonell. The Berry houses a boutique doll collection, which includes historic automata, considered early iterations of modern robots. These pieces reflect the interests and preoccupations of French society at the turn of the 19th century and carry with them the tarnished history of French colonialism. French fashion doll manufacturers created dolls with black complexions for an expanded market. The firm Brew developed this piece in traditional costume of African peoples. These exquisite Bebe dolls are wearing original couture outfits of the period. Born into slavery, Leo Moss was a handyman and carpenter from Georgia who produced unique black dolls modeled after real children. The dolls, with bodies and clothes made from fabric by his wife, became a means of survival for the Moss family. The most recent acquisition in our doll collection is Cynthia, manufactured by the Alexander Doll Company. These pieces were produced from hard plastic for the American market and were more durable than the imported European porcelain dolls. The Berry Art Museum collection continues to grow. In the past year alone, we acquired 30 new works of art. As an organization, we've put particular emphasis on expanding diverse voices that are more representative and reflective of our community, both locally and universally. Visit the Berry Art Museum and take in the many stories that our collection holds.